Scientists in Brazil believe they have an alter alternative tool in the fight against the dengue virus, and they're genetically modified mosquitoes. That's what they're doing. And a pilot program has revealed that it's working. Senator International's Azadeh Ansari is going beyond the headlines. And Azadeh, this sounds like science. It sounds like a science fiction movie that I, I'm going to go to the movies to see. It does. Like it fly. sounds like, like yeah. Jurassic Park ish, yeah. and you have these like genetically modified right. mosquitoes pitted against these wild like mosquitoes. But Brazil implemented this program in, in 2011, and they saw over a six month period, Don, that there was a 90% decrease in the mosquito population, which in turn means a decrease in dengue yeah, fever. Yeah, yeah. But what they're doing, and they just said this today. They started off in the pilot program with 500,000 mosquitoes. Now they're saying, let's try this in a different city with 4 million genetically modified mosquitoes to see what happens. How are they going to do that? Well, it, okay, bear with me. It does sound a little freaky, but okay. they're taking male mosquitoes okay. and they're genetically modifying them to carry a lethal gene against the dengue virus. Then they send these male mosquitoes out into the wild and say, go get those females. They mate with the females. Ah. Then the offspring actually carry this lethal gene. And then the, the offspring don't even become adult mosquitoes. They literally just stay in the larva stage and then they psh, just are destroyed. Oh, really? Fascinating. Have I they know, done so this before? They have. It's been done on a smaller scale, obviously, in the Cayman Islands. It's been done in uh, Malaysia and in Australia as well. But again, this whole concept has environmentalists and public health officials up in arms because even though it's worked in the laboratory and on a small scale, the reality is, is this could have dire implications on a grand scale when you look at what it could do to the environment as well as That's what I mean, playing health. with Mother Nature, I mean, it's, are they sure that they want to do this? Uh, obviously, they have to fight dengue somehow. They do because there's no cure and there's no vaccine against it. So it does give them a glimpse of hope. And though in the U.S. it's not a problem, you know, we don't have outbreaks of mm -hmm. dengue like they do in the rest of the world, mm -hmm. we're talking about nearly 40% of the world's population could be at risk for dengue at some point, you know? So huge problem. This does give them a glimpse of hope for a possible solution and how to combat this, even though it does sound really, really off the charts. And yeah, weird. it's fascinating, though. Thank you. You're welcome, Thank Dad. you. I appreciate it.